Hi, this is Ron Herman again with another frequently asked question. Uh, we had uh, on the website not too long ago, we put up pictures of older tools and such just for uh, from understanding and for some people just amusement, for us they're just our tools. Uh, one of the tools we had was an angle divider we've got some interest in and uh, we're going to try to explain what it's for. Um, this is a miter square you would have if you were doing uh, picture framing say or around a a cabinet where everything is 45 and 90 or divides half of that would be a 22 and a half on a 45. Um, that's great in life if everything's straight and level and plumb, but if you have to end up with an, a, an angle on a cabinet or something that's built in or it has to fit in a certain location that you have an odd angle here that's going to be cut and you need to do some sort of trim work but you want that angle bisected um, you can either do, you know, typically with, uh, with a little bit of geometry, we can swing an arc and we can figure out what that is with a protractor. Um, but that, you know, if you don't have all of that or the math skills. Um, or you can pick one of these up. This is actually a new one. This is an imitation or a, a reproduction of a Stanley tool. Um, I'm going to open it up here and show you how the arms work on it. Um, they open up equally. And what we're going to do is we're going to open it up. I'm going to loosen open it up here and we're going to make it so that it's the same as this angle I have on the board here and as we have it hold it here I can take any of these sides in here and make a mark and that will give me the bisect of this angle here now I can either take a, a bevel square and set it up on here and that gives me that locked angle whatever that is or I can simply just take this tool turn the lock nut down and go over to a miter box uh, whether it be power or hand set this up against the fence and bring my blade over and then lock that in place and that allows me to make uh, reproductive cuts of whatever this angle is here. It's just another tool that helps me without having to do any type of advanced math duplicate joints and uh, solve these little equations here that come up from time to time.